quick unboxing with my smartphone here so that's your packing list there and uh, these are the components on the packing list and then what you got here is this is your manual yeah this is your user manual quick start guide and let's just give a quick gander at this and it's actually very nicely well it's only a couple of pages but they've done a really good job if i zoom in a little bit you can see all the different parts of the board a debug usb port here you've got the boot mode select switch and you've got uh, camera interface you've also got ethernet on this board arduino interface m.2 interface it's got everything it's a bloody cool board here so and then there's another picture on the other side this is the other side of the board i'll show you the board in a minute this has got the lcd interface and the touch interface on the back here so and then on this side you've got a little bit of blurb here on how to get started connect the board via the usb cable to your pc or mac and then it says it comes with a pre-programmed demo that initiates the leds probably that you know hello world via an led flashing led so i'm going to be running up some software on this i'm going to be running up rt thread rtos on this um, so stay tuned for that and that's another a picture of the USB connection there I think let me just check that yeah it's actually yep it's the debug USB port so if you plug that in and put it to your PC you can run up your debugger and that you can then debug the software so what do you got in the box you got the USB cable here USB 2 cable then you've got the board so let's have a look at the board there's not much else in this board so let's just have a quick go under and let's see what happens so let's bring it out there you go this is it this is the board you've got the sd card reader here you've got the ethernet port here and i've told you the debug port up here which is uh up here pretty cool pretty cool board and i'll be powering this up in the next video power it up and put some software on this and run up an rtos show you guys it booting up so we turn it around and there's not much on the back and you know remember there was a touch screen interface and the lcd interface here i think that's the lcd interface there and that is the touch screen interface if you have a touch pad so you can expand this board you know if you're doing a prototype and which has an lcd screen on it and a touch screen you know for a kiosk or something like that or some sort of a multi-touch device you can actually plug that in and prototype it using this board Thank you to NXP and also to the guys and gals at RT Thread for sending this over to me for review. So I'll do a full review of the software booting up on this board very shortly. Catch you later. Cheers.